Hey guys, welcome back to Time Drops and welcome to another video. In the vast ocean of timepieces, there exists a model of watch that stands out among the waves. A truly iconic series that celebrates both its own 30th anniversary as well as its brand's remarkable 40 year legacy all at once. Of course, I'm talking about the G-Shock Frogman, and today we're going to be taking a look at the watch that has been released to commemorate that, the GW8230B-9A. So, ladies and gents, prepare to dive into a world of innovation, durability and unrivaled asymmetric style as we unravel all of its secrets. Looking into the watch's history, price, design and functionality, and then at the end of this video, I'll be giving you my overall verdict. If you're excited to see what's in store and you haven't already, go on over and hit that subscribe button and join our awesome community and then sit back, relax and we'll dive right in. Ah, the G-Shock Frogman, a watch with a history as deep as the ocean itself. As we celebrate the 30th anniversary of this iconic diving line, Casio has graced us with a limited edition timepiece that pays homage to the second generation Frogman DW8200, first released in 1995. And more specifically, it's the design cues of the black and gold DW8200B-9A that serve as the foundation for this here Frogman, showcasing Casio's commitment to both reissuing and evolving this legendary series, which already makes things quite interesting here. Naturally, being the 30th anniversary, one might assume they'd release a reissue of the first generation, the DW6300, that was released in 1993, 30 years ago. Of course, that too was a very popular model that paved the way. And it was thanks to this that by the time the 8200s came around, the Frogman had generated a large amount of interest and these sold out almost instantly, creating a real impact for G-Shock in the diver's world of watches, which is likely what made up their mind for this release. By selecting a historically significant and highly popular model, Casio delivers an anniversary edition that captures the essence of the Frogman's legacy while also celebrating the grand 40th anniversary of G-Shock itself. So it's gotta be good, right? Let's take a closer look. Now, as expected from a high-end timepiece in the G-Shock lineup, this Frogman does come with a price tag that reflects its build quality and advanced features. Priced at $600 in the United States, £519 in the UK, and 77,000 yen in Japan, it certainly falls into the higher end of the G-Shock price spectrum. But as I've already mentioned many times, the Frogman is iconic in its own right. So adding in the exclusive and limited nature of the model commemorating the 30th anniversary makes this one a lot more justifiable. And as a side note, if you're familiar with the brand, you'll know that this is actually at the lower end of the Frogman series. Just take a look at the recent MRG model as an example. The design of this G-Shock Frogman is a true testament to the infamous rugged aesthetic that G-Shock is known for. The GW8230B-9A faithfully reproduces the form, colour and size of the original, providing enthusiasts with a nostalgic yet contemporary timepiece that embodies the spirit of the Frogman series. The ever so recognisable asymmetric design adds a unique and bold element to the watch. Marked perfectly in gold with the word Frogman on the left hand side as you look at the case, while the almost graphite grey bezel is highlighted with the words G-Shock and Titanium, the latter of course referring to its construction. This case not only provides a sleek and modern look, but also ensures exceptional durability, making it a match for whatever you decide to throw at it, if you want to throw something at it. One of the standout design features for this timepiece in particular is the use of biomass plastics for the bezel and band, which is made from renewable organic resources such as castor oil or corn. This eco-friendly material is one we're seeing on a lot of G-Shock models lately, and not only showcases Casio's commitment to sustainability, but again adds to the watch's durability and is just as comfortable on the wrist as the models that came before. This band features a strong and secure fit, allowing the watch to stay firmly in place. I'm not a diver myself, but can't imagine this going anywhere when you're submerged. This new Frogman features four buttons that provide convenient control and access to its various functions. You've got the adjust button at the traditional 10 o'clock, used to make adjustments and set different parameters on the watch. The mode button at eight helps you switch between different modes and menus. The light button, guess what this does? That's right, it gives you the ability to activate the LED back light, which also reveals this Master of G model's iconic character in red, which is awesome. The light makes it more legible, the frog might make it less so, but it's iconic and I love it. And finally, we have the log data button. And this one is worth mentioning as it's a unique feature specific to the Frogman series. It allows you to access and review diving log data stored in the watch. You can view information such as dive times, depth readings, as well as other relevant data from your previous dives. 
The G-Shock Frogman GW8230B-9A is protected by mineral glass and features a multi-section display that provides easy access to various functions and information, all presented in an easy to read and much loved positive display. The three sections of the screen serve different purposes to enhance functionality and usability. The main screen showing the time and date, as well as the watch's many functions as you navigate through, with the large bold digits making this one incredibly legible. Above this, to the right, we see a section dedicated to displaying the tide graph and moon data. Another one synonymous with the Frogman, which helps users plan their activities accordingly. To the left of this and highlighted in a glorious gold is another section, allocated for dive log and interval time measurement. This feature allows divers to keep track of their diving sessions, including dive duration, surface intervals and other related data, enabling users to review and analyse their diving performance. Ultimately, these three sections of the screen provide comprehensive and vital information, making it a reliable companion for divers and outdoor enthusiasts. But if you're not one of those, as is the case with many G-Shocks, also make the watch just look very cool. To further emphasise its connection to the Frogman series, in addition to the backlight, this watch also showcases a frog character on its case back, further adding a touch of playfulness to its design and serving as a nostalgic reminder of the watch's rich history. With its dimensions of 52mm in length, 50.3mm in width and 18mm thick and weighing 84 grams, you may think this watch is rather large, which it is. But, in fact, this is one of the most compact Frogmans to date, and this timepiece strikes the ideal balance between a robust presence on the wrist and, as mentioned, a very comfortable fit. But this 30th anniversary Frogman is not just a stylish timepiece. It's packed with a multitude of functions. We've already touched on a few of them, but let's run through some more. First and foremost, the GW8230 features tough solar power harnessing the energy from both natural and artificial light sources to keep the watch running without the need for battery replacements. This ensures that you never have to worry about running out of power during any adventure you go on. Sporting a battery life of 14 months with general use or up to 36 months with power saving enabled, which you can keep track of thanks to its battery life indicator on the dial. For divers, this watch offers a plethora of features, such as the dive log, as well as the tide and moon graph we've previously run through, but most notably is its water resistant rating of ISO divers 200 meters, allowing it to withstand the pressures of underwater exploration. You might be asking, well, aren't all G-Shocks 200 meter water resistant? And the answer is mostly yes, but the Frogman is still the only one to date that has the official divers ISO certification, which is critical for those heading into the drink. It also features many of those we're used to across all G-Shocks, including a full auto calendar, multiple alarms, a countdown timer, stopwatch and well time. Now, here's an interesting twist. The GW8230 doesn't have the multiband 6 radio timekeeping feature, despite the GW prefix. This is something I know many will be wanting and more recently has been a function we've seen directly in air quotes swapped out for Bluetooth, but this Frogman has neither. And while of course the original 8200 didn't have them and this is effectively a reissue, I do think just one of those being added would have captured that evolution into a modern day timepiece perfectly. So yeah, a bit unexpected, but hey, sometimes surprises keep things interesting, right? And let's not forget that the Frogman line has always been known for its ISO divers 200 meter water resistance and that coveted made in Japan status, which is perfectly presented next to the watch's shock resistant logo. If you're familiar with the channel, you'll know I'm a huge G-Shock fan. If you're not, you've likely cottoned onto that. However, this is the first Frogman I've ever owned. What? I hear you cry? I know, I know. To be honest, I've always been an admirer of the model and well aware of what it has to offer, but for one reason or another, I've never pulled the trigger. When this one was first announced, it really caught my attention and I started to flirt with the idea some more. And when I saw the recent addition of the Red 8230 NT to the line, things got more intense. I'm a fan of that model as well, but a sucker for a timeless black and gold colorway, so here we are. And overall, I'm so glad I finally committed. Yes, the drama is necessary. I'm always so intrigued by my wrist when wearing this, and it appears the same can be said for onlookers. This one's had a lot of attention since wearing it out and about, from watch enthusiasts to those who usually wouldn't look twice, which is what makes this timepiece so great. This G-Shock Frogman combines emphatic style and strong functionality seamlessly, making it an awesome companion for diving adventures as well as your day-to-day -day outdoor pursuits. This watch not only captures the essence of its predecessors, but also pays a magnificent tribute to the iconic designs that came before it. I've mentioned it would have been capped off perfectly with the addition of multiband 6 or Bluetooth, but for me, 
I don't mind updating the time myself, so isn't really a deal breaker by any means. The Frogman's asymmetric design looks just as good today as it did back then, exemplifying its timeless look. Adding in the special touches of the frog character on the backlight and case back creates a real nostalgic connection to the fantastic history of the Frogman series, showcasing Casio's commitment to honouring its heritage and making for one heck of a statement piece for its 30th and 40th birthdays. So if you're looking for a durable, functional, great looking and reliable timepiece that doubles up as a unique collector's item with a story behind it, this new Frogman may just be the one for you. And with all that being said, that just about wraps this one up. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And if you're looking to check out some more unique timepieces, there's a load on the channel. So why not head over and check those out? Thanks again for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.